given that there is a cistern with this measurements and it contains this much of water and it is given that porous bricks are placed in the water until the cistern is full up to the brim each brick absorbs 1/7th of its own volume of water so this must be noted 1/17th of the its own matter and given that how many bricks can be put without overflowing the water every brick being this much so first initially i'll write volume of brick volume of brick will be equal to simply this into 22.5 into 7.5 into 6.5 that will be 22.5 into 7.5 into 6.5 cm cube which will be equal to some some value let's uh, find that later and next volume of system volume of system is equal to 150 into 120 into 110 cm now it contains in this system now let's say this is a system internally system is a cuboid so Uh, some sort of cuboid in this let's say we are placing n bricks so total volume of cistern is equal to volume of cistern is equal to n bricks plus n times volume of bricks if we are putting n bricks plus this 12000 no, i mean sorry 1 lakh 29600 cm cube of water is there additionally minus if n volumes are there then n by 17 times uh, sorry n into volume by 17 times it will absorb water so i'll subtract the value because that much volume is uh, occupied by this uh, bricks only already we are counting in them so and in this both we are counting like see in a brick if we say there is a brick then there we are counting its whole volume but since it's observing some water then uh, here initially we added volume of bricks plus volume of water so this is water plus volume of this thing but these three mutual these two things are mutually uh, like a part of brick is uh, filled with water so that part is added here and that part of water is also added here so what i'm trying to do is instead of twice adding we have to add only once so i am subtracting that part so that is what i have been doing here n into volume of bricks by 17 so this thing will become now this is simply 150 into 120 into 110 this is equal to n into 22.5 so n minus n by n into v this is n into v This is minus n into v by seventeen, so that commonly becomes sixteen by n by seventeen. Do this into seven point five into six point five plus one two nine six double zero centimeter cube. This after doing calculations we will get. So if you, what we will get is so this we get as ninety eight. Sorry, ninety eight. This much is equal to this is six n into this part we get as uh, plus this part is one nine six double zero centimeter cube. So this is we get as this part we got is one zero three two point three five three something like that. So from this I'll get n is equal to that implies n is equal to nineteen lakhs eighty thousand. Minus one lakh twenty nine thousand six hundred. Whole thing by one zero three two point three five three. So this value we get as roughly equal to. So this value I'll get as one seven nine two point four one zero. So that means roughly. So that means roughly we can fill with. We can fill with one seven nine two bricks.